Welcome to the Motorola Solution stand at PMR Expo 2013. There are a couple of things I'd like to tell you about whilst you're on our stand today. The first thing is the brand new MTP 6000 series Tetra Radio, our first TED's capable portable Tetra Radio. And the 6750 also includes a 5 megapixel camera, making it the first Tetra portable radio which allows you to do digital evidential capture. I'd also like to talk to you about our connected vehicle, which includes the MTM 5000 series mobile, as well as real-time video information, and the radio controls are integrated into the canvas system of the car. We're now in the connected vehicle, which is where Motorola are demonstrating how they have uh, integrated a number of applications which you would find in the control room and extend those into the vehicle itself. The applications are presented through a, a touch screen here in the vehicle and what we've actually got on display right now is a typical situation where the officer in the vehicle is driving towards an incident and a live streaming uh, camera at the incident is being able to be sent down and he can see the situation awareness before he gets to the scene. Not only that, but the, the technology allows the officers to then control that camera if they're given permission. So for example, by pressing on the zoom button, they can zoom in on a particular area of interest to get more awareness before arriving at the incident. And this is typical of the sort of uh, applications that we are installing and integrating. Situational video awareness, license plate recognition, video recording from within the vehicle and streaming back out of the vehicle are all examples of what can be done. We have two radios integrated in the car. One radio is connected to this control head, it's a legacy control head which you can control the radio with. The other radio is connected to the internal Mercedes display. Here you can see the MMI or menu of the radio and control it via this press rotate controller. You can push PTT, you can uh, do group calls or individual calls and so on. Via this application you could also control signal lights of the car or the siren. And at the end you can request vehicle ident number, the current mileage and you could also switch between the TMO or DMO or the gateway or repeater mode. We also have a tablet called ET1 by Motorola. With it, you can also control these functions I already explained at the Mercedes internal display. You can see the same display in the ET1 tablet. You can also control the radio in the same way as with the press rotate controller in the car. You can control your signal lights, bar, siren, other lights and flashes. You can request your vehicle ident number, your current mileage and switch between TMO, DMO, gateway and repeater. So you have the same functionalities in the tablet as in the car. Hello, my name is Sean Fitzgerald. We're here today at PMR Expo where amongst other things we're showing the full Moto Turbo DMR range of two-way radios. The latest addition to the portfolio is the uh, entry-level DP1400 series, which provides all of the digital Moto Turbo advantages in a nice, simple, easy-to-use platform. It completes the range where we also have mid- and high-tier radios, including our SL4000 series for front-of-house and managerial users, and also our high-level ATEX DP4000 EX series. With the introduction of the new radios, it means we now have a full suite so that we can offer the right device for the right user 
irrespective of their requirements and their budget. Hopefully you've seen that PMR Expo is a very important show to us for it allows us to meet our customers and our partners from across the area, across the region. We, today I've spoken to customers from Italy, from Georgia, from Germany and from Holland. Just show an example of the kind of people we meet and talk to whilst we're at the show.